Hello friends, I am going to be sewing a bunch of jackets and stuff from blankets, um, so yeah. I'm going to be using this blanket right here to make the cordis up. It is a bunch of dogs and ducks. This tripod is here for filming of Instagram reels. Here's what the back panel is looking like. It's a bunch of dogs and we got a little duck in there. I got to do the front panel, cut out the sleeves and the collar, put in a zipper. Yeah. I apologize that I literally showed you none of the process, but she's done. Or he, I don't know what you like to name your nun and objects after. Look at how cute the dogs. Here's the dog on the front and it's chasing this bird. And then there's another dog and the zipper kind of like goes right in the dog's head. Low key. <laughs> and then the sleeves have a couple dogs and stuff on it. But the back is my favorite. Like, it's so cute. Just so many dogs. And look at this dog. It's gotta be on this side. Oh yeah. It's got a shoe in his mouth and then it's got a stick in its mouth and there's like, ugh, I'm just so obsessed. I love it. On the website, check it out if you're so very interested. I forgot to show you how the quilt looked before. I guess I have like one video, but it's vertical. And I already cut out the pattern pieces and I'm sewing them on right now. It's like a pink Valentine's Day quilt. I have some bias tape. I'm not sure if I'm gonna use it, but it's like this color pink. I don't know if it'll go, but we might put it around the edges and like the collar and I might do a pocket. That might be fun. So yeah. Here's the jacket. It is currently on my website. So if you are interested, go check it out. Yeah, it's cute. I did add the bias tape. I didn't add the pocket. I just thought it looked better without the pockets because it's just, you know, it's just the vibe. If you want to zip it. And let me show you the tag. I've been adding tags into everything, but yeah. But yeah, she's very warm. I've worn her to school a couple times, like college, and everybody loves it. Like I get so many compliments every time I wear this. Another thing that I get compliments on very consistently is this sweater. I did wear it, I think yesterday actually. But look, hearts, bows. I didn't do any filming of the process at all, so I do apologize um, in regards to that. And she's so cute. And look at the tag. Cute. If you want a bunch of compliments, go purchase her. She's on the website. I just have so many Valentine's stuff and I just love it so much. Speaking of Valentine's Day, I also made this extremely cute dress. It's quite wrinkled at the moment. Look at the little Winnie the Poohs. And then it's just like, gathered and look at these massive puff sleeves like i'm so obsessed i think it's like the cutest dress ever it is large so like it's probably a size xl and it could fit i think up to a 4x based on the measurements that i did but if you want this for valentine's day too it's so cute it's also on my website and just like look how good that seam is that's like the sleeve seam i'm so proud of this one and then the little tag. Ugh, I'm just so obsessed. Yeah, I wish I made it more my size so that I could wear it, but I just think it's a little big for me. But if you want it, I would be not opposed. In fact, I would actually be in favor. Also, I made this adorable little bag. It's a little heart bag and it ties in a bow to be adjustable. And it has my tag, of course. And look at the lace. Isn't the lace just precious? Why, hello, people. If you watched my video about starting a business, then you know that my life has drastically changed in the last couple weeks. First off, business. Check it out. Second off, I mentioned that a brand wanted to send me something. And I finally just got the thing that the brand wanted to send me. So I'm going to open it. I haven't seen it yet. I got it last night and I just went to bed. I was very tired, but yeah, let's open it. Before I show you what's inside, let me just tell you this brand, I, it's called like Yeezy. It is a beginner crochet brand. If you are a beginner crochet or you want to learn how to crochet, they send you kits of things that are used to make the thing. So um, they just came out with the cat hat beanie, like the cat beanie kits. So that's what they sent me. So let's look at it. It comes in this little package. See, it's spelled like, Yeezy. So it's supposed to be really easy. And I got the cat beanie in the matcha colorway. And let me just tell you this, this is not sponsored. They just sent this to me. So this is like all of my actual opinions. <laughs> so first thing I see is the yarn. I'm not sure exactly what type of yarn. It feels really soft though. 
It's in matcha colorway and I love, uh, if you know me, you know that I love brown and green and cream. And then it also comes with these little puffs if you wanted to add like a puff string. Two of those. They also sent a darning needle or I think that's what it's called and then two stitch markers and a crochet hook. So if you want to get into crochet, this is, it gives you everything that you need. This comes with QR code to watch the video tutorial or enter the link into your browser. And so you enter the link and follow the video it looks like. So basically this gives you everything that you need to learn how to crochet. So honestly, I chose the cat beanie, but I am actually not the biggest like hat person. Like I actually don't ever wear hats. So unless I really end up changing my personality and becoming a hat person after making this, I might sell it on my website. I'm so excited. This yarn actually feels really nice. Okay, so as I was watching their video, um, I literally just started it, but they did mention that they chose this yarn specifically for beginners because it is less likely to split and it's like pretty durable, which I can see that. It's like kind of woven in a way you cannot see. I'm so sorry. And I do also like how they give out the crochet hook with the like ergonomic like it's supposed to be better for your hands, which is good for beginners because, I mean, you don't want people to get cramps and stop crocheting. Like, I mean, I personally don't really use these because I kind of like just like the metal like ones, but I'm going to use this one obviously for this. It's interesting. I've never actually used one like this, but I know a lot of people do like these a lot more than the metal ones. So I'm glad that they sent that they send these ones out. I have so many projects going on at the moment and I did just buy more yarn. Just how the beanie's going so far. Wait, it might be done actually. Uh, it probably needs a little bit more. Cause you're gonna fold it and then you go off the top and it's like a cat ear. Anyway, yeah, it's really easy to follow along with. Um, but I just bought a ton of yarn because my friend wants to make little knit blankets where you just like hand knit. So we got a bunch of chunky yarn. And then I also bought some more blanket yarn cause my mom wants me to make one for my grandma for just because it was her birthday recently. So it's not like a, on time birthday present, but I'm gonna make her a little flower, like tulip stitch kind of blanket. I made that for my boss's baby, like last year. So she wants the same one basically. So I just bought a lot of yarn and I have to finish my brother's blanket. And then I have my star sweater that I'm working on. It's gonna finish this and then maybe I'll knit a little bit or I'll work on my brother's blanket. I don't know. Guys, she's done. But I like to fold it up, but yeah. And then I didn't add the pom-poms, but like you can totally do that if you want. I think that I personally look stupid in hats, but that could just be a personal issue that I have to get over. It's nothing to do with the brand. It's just, I, I think that I look stupid, but other people look really cute. So if you want this, it is going to be on my website. I don't know when, but very soon it will be. Or if you just want to comment and tell me that you want it, then I can just reserve it for you anyway. So if you want it, let me know. <sighs> but other than that, that's that. Also, they did send me a discount code. It is Elena15 and you can get 15% off if you order from this brand. If you wanna learn how to crochet, I would actually recommend. They do, they give you all the resources you need to learn. And yeah, seems pretty chill in my opinion. I just woke up, wow. I just woke up to my dear roommate asking me if I wanted to go to a formal ball with her tonight. So, I'm gonna make a dress. I have like six hours, seven hours, eight hours. I don't know, because I still have to shower and get ready and stuff, but using this lovely organza fabric. This blue underneath, how cute. I'm gonna do some shirring, puff sleeves, and then like a circle skirt with a ruffle at the bottom, if I have enough fabric for that. So we'll see. I cut out really long tubes. This tube is connected to the organza. And then this is the lining tube. I'm gonna sew them together at the top, right sides together, but I'm going to also sew in some straps. And then after I sew in the straps, I can do the shirring and then I can sew in the puff sleeves. Beautiful. I did shirring at the top and then I even added a little elastic to be like, so it's like tight because the shirring didn't work all that well with tbh isn't she adorable and like the sleeves and yeah she's not finished though because like the seams aren't amazing i just i had to go quick because i had to go to the ball but let me try her on for you 
Isn't she so cute? I'm obsessed. Anyway, um, I also wore her to church on Sunday, which I know, a little bit overdressed for church, but I got a lot of compliments. Yeah, but she's so cute. I got both these fabrics from the thrift store, or like one from an estate sale, one from a thrift store, so. I mean, I might have already said that. I cannot remember. However, have I told you the story of the ball yet? I don't think I have. In fact, I actually know for a fact that I haven't, so I don't know why I even asked, especially since you cannot respond. But basically, we're going to this ball and it's for a roofing company, but we didn't know like why they were throwing this ball. We just like got this link from like my roommate's cousin's friend. I don't know, it was this whole thing. We got this link and we were like, okay, well, let's go, why not? And so we get there and it's like, people are dressed like so fancy. So I'm like underdressed in this. Which I mean, I guess it's not that much of a surprise, but people were wearing like full on like ball gowns. Like it was insane, but we're there and it's so very enjoyable, but we're so confused. Like what is going on? Okay, we're sitting at the table eating their food and we're just so confused, but we're having a good time. And my roommate's like cousin and his like friends, and I don't know, a lot of, and her brother, like everyone was, there's a lot of people there that, not a lot, but there's like seven or eight of us. And the CEO comes over to us and he's like, how'd you guys hear about this? And we're like, oh, we heard from our friend. And so the guy's like, okay, we're chill with that. Have fun, like, yeah. We find out that the reason that we're here is because my roommate's cousin's friend has a friend who has a friend that tailored a suit for one of the higher ups and then got invited and then she invited some of her friends who then invited him who invited the friend who invited the cousin who invited my roommate and then who invited us which is like this long chain of people but like we were not supposed to be there it was like a full-on company party and like they like we know their whole budget their goals what they did last year their accomplishments and there was like an award ceremony and everything. Anyway, it was insane, but we just had a good time. We were just chilling, we danced and we ate and it was fun. <laughs> but yeah, now we're part of the family of the roofing company that hosted it because they told us, he was like, well, since you guys are part of the family, come join us for the award ceremony. So anyway, it was just really funny, but yeah, that's what this dress is for. Love it so very much. Anywho, oh. So cute. Okay, that's besides the point. I mean, not really, that is kind of the point of this video. I am probably going to end it here because it is Thursday, which means tomorrow is Friday and I'm trying to post now consistently on Fridays. So yeah, I'll just leave it here like this. But let me tell you guys, if you haven't already checked out my website, please just go check it out. Even if you're not gonna buy anything, like even if you know for a fact you're not gonna buy anything, just like go look at it, you know? Let me know if I could do anything to change it. And also, in my contact me section, I have like an area for commissions. So if you're interested in me making anything for you, like like if you like this dress and want a similar one, but like in different fabric because it's a thrifted fabric, but like, you know, just tell me what you want and I'll tell you if I can do it, which I probably and most likely can and I will. So yeah, I'll let you know the pricing and everything. And yeah, if there's any like things that I made in the past, like sweaters or like a skirt or like other dresses, or just tops or anything. Anything that I've sewed or crocheted or even knitted because I've knitted something before now, but I mean, <laughs> anything that you want, just let me know and I'll let you know if I can do it. But yeah, just, just let me just get that into your brain. I can make things for you, okay? Let me make things for you. I love making things. Also, look what I'm knitting currently. It's like a Conan Gray inspired shirt and look, it's like a black star for like his new album that's coming out so soon. Very much excited for that. But yeah, video is gonna be coming out about this sweater. So if you're very interested, stay tuned for that. Anyway, have a good day. Check out Yeezy, Yeezy, whatever. They're in the description box with the coupon code of Alina15 to get 15% off your order. If you're interested in learning how to crochet or you just want the kit. Anyway, yeah, have a good, amazing, lovely day. Bye-bye.